thank you to the EA Creator Network for providing me with early access to The Sims 4 Horse Ranch Expansion Pack. Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. So today I want to have a look at Cass and I want to look at Cass combined with some of their expansion packs. So I love Cass from Horse Ranch. I think it's really, really nice. There's a lot of pieces that I just know I'm going to use again and again and again in my game. I can't rave about it enough. Um, but it really complements some other packs really well. So if you're into animal gameplay, if you like farm animals, um, kind of gardening, all that kind of content. Um, I find that Horse Ranch, Cottage Living and Seasons combine really well together. So I'm going to do a couple of videos. This is going to be on Cass um, and I'm just going to use Base Game, Seasons, Horse Ranch and Cottage Living and kind of show you some outfit combinations and how they all have this kind of farmy, cottagey, horsey vibe that I think works really well together. So uh, just jumping in, so just ignore my animals. Mm. You'll meet them in the next video. Uh, this is a summer outfit because it's because I've got seasons installed, so it's summer in my game right now. But if I jump to every day, you can see how I've combined some of these outfits. So this new jacket, which is probably one of my favorite favorite outfits from uh, Horse Ranch. I'm gonna get so mixed up, guys. So do double check, like fat check what I'm saying. Look at the icons when I click on the, the items to know which pack they're from. Uh, this jacket is definitely from Horse Ranch and I love the tassels on it. It comes in some really, really beautiful colors. I've combined it with this hair, which I believe is from Cottage Living. Yeah, Cottage Living hair. Where's the hat from? Cottage Living. And the skirt I think is also Horse Ranch. And these boots, oh they're actually nifty knitting. So I lied. Sorry guys, I uh, I got a little bit mixed up there. But apart from that, I think everything else is from those expansion packs. I'm such a new guys. But I think they work really well. Those nifty knitting boots. The reason why I think I've ended up with nifty knitting is because I'm using that for the gameplay and somehow I've ended up with it with the cast. I just trust me to mess up at like the first hurdle. Uh, you can also see I've given Cinderella a lot of animal themed traits up here. So she has friend of the animals, uh, animal enthusiast, horse lover and rancher. So horse lover and rancher are two new traits that came with horse ranch. Uh, animal enthusiast is uh, cottage living and friend of the animals is cats and dogs. So I think I'm probably going to have most of the animals that come in these expansion packs kind of covered with some kind of uh, some kind of goal orientated or trait based gameplay. Uh, but there's a few other things as well. So just to kind of show you if we're going animal here that's cats and dogs where's uh let me try to forget instantly where everything is so uh cottage living comes with country caretaker that's more themed at like the chickens and the cows and the llamas and horse ranch is athletic up here you've got championship rider uh so there's lots and lots of gameplay there kind of around animals um and if we jump in here as well i think if under activities so she likes cross stitch Horse riding, naturally, knitting, nectar making, uh, all the good stuff, all the vibes. Uh, so yeah, let's get back to Cass because that's what this video is supposed to be about. Um, and I'll kind of show you how I've kind of mixed and matched and combined some outfits from all these different packs. I do find that they combine very, very well. So when I was doing this, I did go through and use the filters to kind of, uh, so if you're not, if you're new to the, I can't speak. If you're new to The Sims 4 and you're not sure what filters are, if you open the filter panel here and go to packs, I mean, there's all different ones that for like styles. So you can go ahead and go for like outdoorsy or country or something like that if you want to. Uh, fashion choice, do they like masculine or feminine uh, orientated clothing, colors, material, all that good stuff. But I'm interested today on packs. So I enabled base game, cats and dogs, not cats and dogs, sorry. That's because I'm playing with cats and dogs as well. I've got a lot of packs, well, I've got all the packs installed, um, but I'm trying to like focus on certain ones. So for cats, base game, seasons, cottage living, and horse ranch um, and yeah like the base game stuff there too so uh, these are kind of the things that I was dealing with and I just used assets I hope from these packs oh my goodness words are hard let's just look let's just look through uh, so this one here, so the hat and the top are both from Horse Ranch and I kind of love that Midwestern kind of like country theme. I do think again it complements really well. So there's things in Horse Ranch that I think you could easily find on like a British kind of um, 
farm as well and vice versa so yeah top and hat from Oh my goodness top and hat from horse ranch these bottoms are yeah. from cottage living and again they just look super cute so another really cute denim option there uh, to complement horse ranch really well and these really cute kind of boho boots are also from horse ranch uh, let's keep going so this little cute outfit here how adorable is this like with the boots like all the stitching detail is Hi. so so sweet so the hair again is the uh, cottage living hair I think the hat's cottage living it is indeed the top I believe is also cottage living yep uh, this adorable skirt and again the skirt looks like cottage core so it complements cottage living really really well uh, like Hempford on Bagley are gonna get like such a big fashion injection they are excited angle and Agnes crumple bottom is clutching her handbag and inside she's got lots of money because she wants to shop for this clothing uh, yeah so uh, the top is from uh, cottage living this skirt is from horse ranch and I can't get enough of this skirt it's one of my favorite skirts already in the game uh, and these beautiful boots with this stitching detail are all also from Horse Ranch. Now, if you aren't keen on the stitching detail, they do have like plain options as well. So you don't have to have that, but I think it's very, very cute, especially because Cinderella Sim uh, at the moment is gonna be into kind of like knitting and cross stitching. I thought she could have like done all that detail herself, you know? Um, this outfit here, uh, so this outfit is um, from horse ranch and it's this kind of uh kind of we can do it boiler suit which i think is super cute and i've combined it with the hair and the hat also from horse ranch so actually this outfit is fully horse ranch i just i doubled down i don't know what can i say um and i put i put it with the base game trainers i think it'd look really cute actually if we were going to kind of like look at other packs um these kind of little converse style from uh werewolves i think would be brilliant with it as well maybe even like the vans where were those vans where did they go i lost the vans maybe even like the vans from uh Grunge kit? Were they from Grunge kit? There's so many kits, I've kind of lost track. That's a really cute outfit too. Uh, again, just as a slightly different vibe from the kind of cottage core look, if you want to go a little bit more um, down the kind of grunge vibe, I think that works really, really super well. So I love all this mix and match potential. Again, I I wasn't using the trainers from the Grunge Kit and uh, Werewolves, but they would go great with this outfit. These pants are the same ones that we saw over here from Cottage Living, uh, and they're just in this yellow color, and they combine with this horse ranch top super duper well. I really love this top, how it has the vest that tucks in and the shirt that tucks over. I think it's very, very flattering, and I really like it. And again, the horse ranch hat and the horse ranch hat. I just need to check what that text message was. I'll be back in a second. We're okay. I thought it might be one of my kids. One of my kids is away at Alton Towers today, um, which is exciting for them, but nerve wracking for me as a parent. So I just kept on. I just might have to check my phone every now and again, but it was just one of my Discord friends. So shout out my Discord friends. Hi, I love all your faces. Thank you for keeping me entertained and giving me social motive bar energy. <laughs> Uh, here is one of her formal wear outfits. So again, super, super cute. I love this adorable dress, which I believe is from Cottage Living again. I swear, I have used a little bit of Seasons here and there. Oh my goodness. I just, you know when the EA app just has a breakdown mid-recording? That's just happened. Go away, EA app. Um, okay, now it's freezing. <laughs> of course it is. Of course it's freezing. Oh my goodness, the EA app is uh, not my favorite thing in the world. Okay, I think we're still, I think we're back. Um, so uh, yeah, so she's got this adorable dress from Cottage Living. The shoes are from Cottage Living. The new hair, which I think complements this outfit really well, is from uh, Horse Ranch. So very, very, very cute little outfit there. Very vintage, I love it. Um, we've also got this outfit here, which I thought worked well for, for um, formal wear. It's kind of making me think of um, the kind of color palette of Inky on Arrivals, which was such a beautiful kit. Uh, so she's got these really cute pants from uh, oh, Cottage Living again. I was intending to use Seasons. I don't really know what happened. Maybe it's just Horse Ranch and Cottage Living. <laughs> I was kind of in the zone, guys, so I don't know. Uh, the shoes? 
the, the boots are perhaps from, they're not tagged for formal, but there you go, yay, the boots are from Seasons. I really love these boots, I was so excited when we got them, uh, just because I think a lot of the boots in the game are kind of too chunky looking, and these are kind of like really sleek and flattering, and I use these quite a lot. Actually, when I first got them, I overused them, and now I'm kind of like trying to pull back. Uh, but yeah, I kind of like how tonal that outfit is, and this is just that little really cute um, horse ranch shirt again. Um, it is denim, so it's not particularly made for formal wear you can see it's not tagged for formal wear but again just kind of like looking at different options and alternatives and different ways of using things I think it looks great I love it with this hair and then I've just given her these little like pearl earrings that are kind of like classic uh, and I think this look is very very clean like uh -huh. clean lines she looks fresh I think she looks great like ready for like a backyard wedding you know um, and then here is her other outfit. So she's got that really amazing um, hair that's just been patched to the base game. Um, it was kind of like Native American hairstyles because you get some plaits and things with it as well. But this hair is just so usable. I feel like it's going to look really, really good on teen sims. And uh, it really suits Cinderella. You can see actually I've got my hair. Normally I have my hair curly. It's quite, quite straight today. It's actually kind of driving me mad. So if you see me messing with it, that's kind of why. Uh, my hair's in my armpits as well. Uh, so yeah I think this is um, I'm really really happy to see more of these kind of longer styles I think it's really pretty how it has this kind of like little flick at the end it's not kind of like uh, which is how I like my hair I like to cut my hair on a on a curve I don't like it to be flat at the bottom so uh, I think it's really really pretty I wish mine looked that good at the ends mine are a bit dry just comparing myself to a sim here guys uh, that kind of like middle parting as well which all the teenagers in this area oh, like all the young girls all the teenagers they all have this Madison beer middle parting so really happy to see that would love a few more variants on that maybe like with one with the hair in her armpits you know like like whatever I've got going on here like that would be good too I just love some more long kind of uh yeah just more long hair options basically without accessories as well which so this is exactly what I've been wanting so thank you sims team that's amazing um and uh not that it's like a special delivery just to me but it is something that I felt was missing from the game and if I felt that I'm sure others did too so really happy to see that um, and this cottage living dress, which is just absolutely adorable. It's very mumsy, but I kind of like the vibe today. Uh, and these really cute kind of vintage shoes, once again, from cottage living. The necklace is also from cottage living. So this is just basically a cottage living outfit again. But like I say, like, even though some of the outfits use more from one pack than another, you can see how complimentary they all are. They all have this kind of a farmy feel to them which is really cute so even though this is cottage living especially if I kind of change the color to something like that it could absolutely be on like a midwest horse ranch maybe take the maybe take the pearls off maybe put some cowboy boots on her and she would look like Midwest America farm girl do you see what I mean like very little house on the prairie we love it um let's keep going uh, i'm feeling very alexis today you know from <laughs> i don't know what it is i'm a little bit alexis um from schitt's creek <laughs> I don't know what that vibe's about. I've not been watching it or anything. Uh, so here again is another great example of like uh, kind of British equestrian wear. So British, uh, like horses are a big thing in Britain, especially within the upper classes. We have like horse racing, which I don't know how I feel about horse uh -huh. racing. I kind of feel like it's a bit mean on the horses. Uh, but we have kind of like, it's, it's kind of like jockey clothing, but also kind of like equestrian wear. So we have things like show jumping um, and um, I guess the equivalent of what the game calls um, Western pleasure, sort of uh, just kind of like showing off your horse training skills and kind of like doing the jumps and things like that. So uh, Jim Carner, I think it's called. So this looks very much like a British equestrian wear. We've got the hat and the boots from uh, Ranch Life. And again, even though it's, it's Midwestern horse wear, it it works for British horsewear too. And then this is the little, cot is it cottage living? I feel like it's cottage living. It's not actually tagged for athletic, but it felt like horse riding is athletic. So that's kind of what I was going with this vibe. Uh, yeah, it was Seasons, shout out Seasons. We finally used her. Yeah, this adorable little Seasons kind of uh, equestrian style jacket. So I think she looks kind of fab. <laughs> I love it. Very, very British, very at home in Hempford on Bagley, I feel. Uh, Cinderella has a 
bit of money from nectar making I think uh, and then this is a bit more of a casual outfit with that kind of very cute vintage hat that comes with horse ranch I really really love how it's kind of like a bit worn and vintage it's like clearly somebody's favorite hat I feel like you know they went to a baseball game with the dad maybe the star player kind of like put the hat on the kid's head and they've treasured it forever that's the vibe that that hat gives me it's got like a bit of a story in my mind uh, this little top is just a little horse ranch t-shirt uh, and we've got these base game uh, pants and, and uh, shoes as well there uh, this is a very, very simple little sleepwear outfit. Um, it's just that cute little kind of, it's like an undershirt, isn't it? What do you call them? Like long johns? It kind of reminds me of long johns. Uh, so yeah, a little long john shirt. Uh, and just, just the briefs under there as well. Again, I was kind of limited to... Um, this pack uh you could always put it on with uh like these base game pajamas as well though uh that works perfectly well um let's go to party i need to eat food i, I keep forgetting to eat i'm so excited about a horse ranch i'm just like in the game in the zone and like things like food are just suddenly not necessary until like <laughs> until i start recording and my tummy starts rumbling and then i'm like oh yeah i need to eat <laughs> i'll eat I'll eat eat is for the week as i sleep i'll eat when i I'll eat when um, I completely just run out of ideas for horse ranch. That's when I'll eat. Uh, so here you go. These are kind of like party outfits. I really, really love this dress. This is kind of one of my favorite dresses in the game from Cottage Living. This cute, it's like a little cute wrap dress. I think it's really sweet. And then I've just given it this kind of like more kind of country and Western feel by giving her the cowboy boots and the cowboy hat. She could absolutely be like a country and Western music singer. Like I could see Taylor Swift wearing that. Honestly, guys, I really could. Uh, and the hair is cottage living as well uh, you do get new eyebrows as well with the base game patch which is very very cool she hasn't actually got them on but let me just show you uh, these kind of very nice eyebrows and there's some wacky ones as well <laughs> uh, but I really love them I love the texture on them uh, I think the Sims Human done a good job on those um, but I'll keep the ones that she's got on her for now I just kind of wanted to show you that that was a thing because it's easily missed if you haven't seen the tweets about it very easily missed mm -hmm. uh, this outfit which I thought was super cool I got quite excited when I put this on her it's not my normal style I don't think I've ever in my life used that top I didn't like it when I first got cottage living and I don't think I've used it on any sims um but with the horse ranch uh really cool like flares uh, and that awesome hat and then like her hair down and a little bit kind of messy i just think she looks really really cool was drew barrymore in like a western film was i don't know she's reminding me of drew barrymore for some reason and she's also got like the cowboy boots on i don't know for some reason i absolutely am in love with the outfit which is so funny because i never liked that top until now um um, this is another cute little outfit in the game. Uh, this skirt is from Cottage Living and again I don't think I've used that skirt very much in the game until now and then suddenly I'm like hey I suddenly like this skirt and I'm gonna use it all the time and I really like it with this kind of like horse sorry my hair's like I'm not used to having it like this guys I'm used to having it curly and just kind of throwing it over my shoulder. Uh, it's kind of too slippy. <laughs> um, yeah this top is from horse ranch again love how it kind of tucks in and tucks out and i think it just looks really cute and casual with that little skirt uh she's got the horse ranch hat and the horse ranch boots and the cottage living hair with that gorgeous plait at the back um here's the horse ranch uh side plait with the horse ranch hat the horse plait ranch top and this skirt which is from cottage living yet again i think horse ranch and cottage living are like you know, they're like the hand of God touching Adam. They just work really well together. And was it Adam? I don't know who the hand of God touched. I assume it was Adam. Um, and uh, yeah, so that that's got super cute as well. And again, it comes in like even plain textures. So if the check's a bit too much for you, you can kind of tone that down. But this navy blue kind of denim shirt is just, is so good for matching with things. It matches with so many things that I'm like, do you know what? I never knew what to do with this skirt until now. And this top has been such a blessing. It's like suddenly I'm finding that I can use all these assets that I've kind of like sidelined or overlooked in the past, uh, just because maybe I couldn't find the right thing to mix and match with it and now like all my blessings are here <laughs> uh horse ranch cowboy boots there uh and then this as well like this this little top is a variant uh that came with uh 
Horse Ranch and I like this top I like this kind of like initial swatch some of the swatches are maybe not my jam uh, I don't see myself using them a lot but I actually really like this combination with these cute little shorts from Cottage Living again that come in like a variety of great colors uh, very nice very usable shorts there um, I think because the shirt tucks in and the, the shorts sit just at the right height, I actually really love that outfit with the horse ranch. No, oh, this is base game. This is a base game hat, guys, and the horse ranch boots. And I think she is ready to go and learn some like country and western kind of like line dancing. Cinderella is down for that. I like somebody invite me. I want to do that. I did it when I was like really young with my nana, and I kind of like it's come back around again. And I'm like, please, somebody invite me to like. A line dancing party where you learn da line dancing because I am like you know I am ready for that um so swimwear so again I am so sick of the base game swimwear it's actually kind of driving me crazy because I've been working with uh, up until now because I've got there's two types of early access there's early early access where you just get the base game and whatever pack it is you've got early access to which is like the very early access and then there's a kind of like normal early access where you just get the pack a little bit like a day or two in advance before everybody else before it gets like released um, so the early early access was just base game and horse ranch and now I've got it in my game with like all the assets like all, all the packs and I just I am in like cast heaven a lot of you know I really like creator sim I've actually had sims on the front page of the main menu screen which was surreal to me I couldn't quite take it in I think I underplayed it quite a lot of the time because I was just kind of like wait what little old me <laughs> but yeah so I, I don't know I can think I'm kind of okay at creator sim uh so yeah to have all these new assets that I've been playing with for the last week or so and to be able to like finally get them with all my other kind of creator sim clothing I I'm just in like clothing heaven I really really am so uh yeah I've been stuck with like the bit I've made so many sims like you'll see them all on like my shorts and my channel I've got so many videos on cast um but like to just have the base game swimwear it's been killing me because there's so limited options so I was really excited to get this one from Seasons uh, again really cute little swatches on that um, and I love these kind of like I think these are Seasons sunglasses yeah these cute little vintage sunglasses with that horse ranch kind of like updo she looks very Audrey Hepburn or like not Mar maybe Marilyn Monroe a little bit uh, I don't know she looks kind of like vintage glamour like classic old hollywood and i am here for it i love that outfit um and then here we go like with the horse ranch hair as well really cool uh horse ranch hair again these really adorable um co uh, cottage living earrings i think cottage living uh, Cottage Living came with loads of earrings and then I feel like Seasons had a few as well let me just kind of Seasons uh, Cottage Living Horse Ranch uh, yeah so here you go like yeah Seasons and Cottage Living have all these different cute earrings they're really really adorable um, so if you're looking for more earring options like again good packs for that uh, and then this really cute little like uh, jumpsuit boiler suit effort from um, horse ranch just really adorable and then I've been putting this with cowboy boots this whole time because it works with cowboy boots but to have a slightly different option with these kind of uh, kind of uh, what would you call that like crocheted wedges like uh rope wedges uh they just give it a really cute summery vibe again like they're really nice in white as well uh so those are from cottage living and i just find them it's just a really really cute like pretty summer outfit uh we've also got this outfit again for when she's back on the farm but it's quite warm so she's got those really cute shorts on from cottage living again the ones with the check uh just in kind of like a plain dark navy option she's got one of the cute little check shirts on from horse ranch and then those wellies from cottage living which again aren't enabled for hot weather but i see cowboy boots and wellies as like festival wear uh -huh. um i definitely remember circa 2000 sort of Kate Moss, Sienna Miller, everybody at, at Glastonbury with the little boho dresses on and the wellies and the cowboy boots it was a whole thing uh, so I see them as summer wear because you know what like if you're if you go into a festival it gets muddy it might be sunny but you know you need you need decent footwear uh, so yeah these little cute uh let's just 
take that off. Yeah, cottage living wellies, just adorable. And again, just brilliant workwear. So if you're mucking out your horses in Chestnut Ridge, maybe you want a nice pair of wellies and cottage living has your back. Uh, not everybody needs to wear cowboy boots all the time, as cool as they are. Uh, and here we go. So again, with that kind of uh, horse ranch hair, that one again is the cottage living hair. You're gonna see repeats. Uh, this little cottage living top and now this is one of my favorites this is a top that I use all the time like too much in my game look how cute it is with that as well so this is from high school years uh, how adorable is that little high school years top with those shorts the shorts are new from horse ranch I think that is a really sweet outfit I love all the boho stuff uh, that as well from high school years that works really well as well with like the rag tie um, like bell and kind of like the crochet detail you could totally wear that out in the midwest really really cute there's just so many options again i'm trying to focus on those kind of like four packs base game cottage living mm. seasons and horse ranch but again you can there's just so much good stuff in the game now and there's so many opportunities to mix and match so um i'm living out my best cast dreams at the moment uh yeah this is really cute it comes in a lot of different swatches some are plain this mustard one's really really nice uh but this white with the pink flowers i think is really pretty and i do use it a lot uh and then these little horse ranch shorts are just super cute i think i'd prefer if the the, uh, the belt wasn't quite so shiny on those I think I prefer if it was more of a matte texture, but it's just a small detail. I'm not that fussed about it. And again, she's got those really cute little cottage living uh, wedged, wedged sandals on there as well with that. Oh, and some more earrings as well. So which pack do these earrings come from? If you can just click on them, it's not letting me. Uh, cottage living for those ones. And let's keep going. So she's got the horse ranch hair, the horse ranch hat and uh, the horse ranch skirt which complements this top super well so just have a look here at kind of the, can you see how the red changes on that one to kind of like a bit more of a brownie red there's like a brownie skirt to match like the colors complement super duper well on this one um, so I feel like that was done I don't know if it was done intentionally but I do wonder if it was like brilliant mix and match potential with that one um so really happy for that let me just kind of flick back to where we were there we go that's the one that i ended up with but there's a lot of mix and match op options and this is a swatch that i find quite hard to to put on sims with this top i tend to go for like the black the red the the blue the pink uh, and then these swatches while i really really like the pattern i've always found it quite hard to kind of like decide what to pair it with and i think it works with that skirt super duper well and then again just horse ranch cowboy boots just topping ah. off that look it's a it's it's a bit of a clashing col color combination so it's one of those ones where i'm kind of like does it work does it not work mm, i'm not quite sure but i think i like it let me know what you think in the comments if you like that one or not we'll call it the bunny top the bunny mushroom top the Alice in Wonderland outfit that's what we'll call that one um and then this which how cute is that little outfit so definitely I could see her uh hanging out at the bar do you know serving some nectar kind of doing the whole western dancing thing and again very Taylor Swift I feel with the red lipstick so she's got that side ponytail from horse ranch the base game hat the horse ranch handkerchief top while although I cannot wear that in real life because I need structural support here uh, I would just be I would be flapping in the wind <laughs> if I tried to wear that um, I love it for the sims and it's very very again circa 2000 this kind of style was really big and so I think it's such an iconic piece I'm so glad they included it in the game and it looks great on sims even if it's like not very wearable in real life uh, and then these little seasons short so seasons is having a moment here uh they're just a really pretty short these and i think in black they match the handkerchief top really well a lot of the time when i just was playing with horse ranch and the base game with the early early access i kept on putting the handkerchief top on with the denim flares because uh, that's how i remember people wearing it like the the low rise flare jeans and the handkerchief top it was it was a look back in the day um but yeah wearing it and kind of modernizing it with these really cute shorts i think works perfectly and just keeping it very very clean with the colors like black and red and that touch of white i think works really super duper well now this is kind of like the piece de resistance because both cottage living and cottage living seasons and 
Horse Ranch all have very good winter wear games. So uh, this little uh, cottage living coat, which I adore, is like I could see my late great queen mother, not queen mother, she's the queen, she'd be the, the queen, the queen, Queen Elizabeth. I could totally see her driving her little Jeep around her little land. You know, it's very landed gentry, I think is what I'm trying to say, with that little flat cap and the little shirt underneath. Oh, it's so cute and it's so British. Like, I can't, I love it. Um, Like very, like, I don't know, it's kind of like giving Jeremy, Jeremy Clarkson's farm, but in a good way. Do you see what I'm saying? And then like these little base game jeans and uh, these amazing boots that I am absolutely in love with. Again, one of my favorite items from this pack in just the plain kind of like brown suede uh oh with the new gloves as well like shout out the new underrated gloves from um horse ranch which is so nice to have so just compare these gloves here with this kind of like they kind of look a bit thicker like they look like gloves where these are a bit too skin tight i feel i mean they're okay but i think these are a definite improvement in terms of like the fit the style the mesh of them i really like these these gloves and I'm happy to have them. What I feel like I'm really missing now and it's such a disappointment that we didn't get it in cottage living or nifty knitting are like mittens, like knitted gloves. I need them for all ages. It's like a big thing that I really, really do feel is missing from the game. So if we could possibly get those at some point team, that I, like Sims team, if you happen to watch this, knitted gloves please my cottage core my cottage core heart needs it uh but yeah beautiful outfit and again with that kind of uh cottage living uh ponytail there here's another really cute outfit and i'm not showing you everything i'm not showing you the entirety of the cast from these packs just some pieces that i picked out that i wanted to kind of play around with and mix and match that i thought suited cinderella uh so yeah so uh really adorable little jumper and it kind of has these like christmasy ones as well on there uh i've got these little like snowman earrings which i think came from seasons uh this hat I, i'm a bit sad that ugh, this hairstyle i really really love this hairstyle from a uh, cottage living but I would love that you know how we just got that really long straight gorgeous hair patched to the base game I kind of wish we could get let me just take the hat off I kind of wish we could get something similar to this and similar to that base game hair but without the accessory and this is exactly what I keep saying it's like the accessory really limits how much I can use this hair especially because the color of this accessory is is like tied to the color of the hair and while it's really really pretty if I use that I'm limited to using things that match with that green color or match with that purple color so um again like it's such a shame as well because we do get two options but they both have pink with the blonde it's like well what if i don't like what if i don't want her to wear pink so i really kind of wish one of these options had had bright colors and one of them would have had like base colors like black and white and navy blue you know things that are easier to match such a wasted opportunity considering we got two versions uh but yeah i would love to get that specific hair without that accessory and like just coming down forward a bit past the ears you know sort of like that like that with still with like the little twizzle like i think it's really it's a really really pretty hair and it frustrates me all the time that i can't use it because it doesn't match the item so again i just kind of put that little um if i can flick through i mean it's not awful but sorry guys like i've just put the hat on her just to kind of cover it up a little bit from the front i think it looks really pretty you can kind of see it peeking through from the side which looks a bit weird but um like that's just how hats are in the game they don't come down that low but just let's move swiftly on from that like from the front adorable <laughs> let's all agree from the front super cute um and then like the little cut, uh, horse ranch boots again which i absolutely adore and again i think these are really really nicely meshed and it's such a shame that i can't zoom in on them i kind of wish there was like a, like something here along the ui that 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 controlled where the camera zoomed in at so when i zoom in the camera it always zooms in at face so i wish there was like face midsection feet like toggle options and if i clicked feet and zoomed it would zoom in at her feet rather than her 
head as well like if I clicked here and zoomed in it zoom in more on a hand area so I could see the detail of like the nails and the uh, rings because it doesn't always zoom in and like gloves and things so uh, yeah if I could like or like have some kind of like slider you know how we have the sliders for the waist and things I wish I had some kind of like camera pitch slider that I could scroll and then zoom um, that would be very very helpful for cast please again sims team if you happen to be watching this, that'd be amazing. Uh, just writing out my wish list, you know, for Santa for this year. <laughs> and the Sim Gurus are my Santa. Um, anyway, yeah, If I, I wish I could show you the detail of these boots better because I love that little gold kind of uh, tag on there. It's got like a little metal gold tag, which I think just makes it look like it's a higher quality product. And then it's got like a little tassel zip that actually just kind of stick out. Can you see how it sticks out? From the actual boot itself so i just i think the detail the stitching detail as well around the boot and there's such a nice shape like whoever is on the sims team and doing the modeling and then the kind of designs for the new footwear that we've been getting recently i swear like the footwear game is like here on the sims at the moment like i, I went crazy when i saw the footwear in horse ranch uh and then let's just keep going so base game jeans on that one base game jeans here this is a new horse ranch top again that totally looks like you could wear that in Hemford on Bagley and not look out of place she's got the new gloves on she's got the cottage living hat on and uh those absolutely again just the footwear game recently the footwear in horse ranch is so beautiful I can't believe that we get like as well if we take off the feminine tag uh we get like five uh, I think it's five um different sh shoe options and they're all stunning so the masculine kind of cowboy boots work really well on women as well there's no reason why you couldn't take that tag off and use that uh but yeah like I adore those boots I kind of want them in real life they're so nice I feel like I'd be paying about 180 quid for them though they look like you know they look like proper equestrian wear and proper equestrian wear brands are like expensive uh but they are super super pretty and I love how you have options of kind of like uh base game jeans that tuck in and then like jeans from horse ranch that go over so you kind of have like the best of both worlds there and I, I love that I look because the sims team could have given us another pair of skinny jeans but I'm like well we've got a couple of pairs of skinny jeans in the base game anyway and then these really cute like turn ups so the fact that they've given us things like flares and then like these amazing ones with the chaps like I love it so much so again like the thought that went into the cast I don't know if they planned for it to complement city living um or if it was just a happen chance and you know it it worked out really well uh but if it was planned if they the sims team so I do think it was sim guru bat who um so uh, Nina sim guru bat I think she had they had a a really big hand in designing the cast for this pack so I believe I could be wrong on that I need to fact check that one it's just I heard it somewhere in the wind but the answer my friend is blowing in the wind sim guru bat did some good stuff on this pack <laughs> um, so yeah I don't know if it, if it was kind of like planned and you know they went into that level of detail of kind of like looking at all the colors in cottage living and like the complimentary swatches and like what was missing of kind of like British equestrian wear and then they brought it in because it just mixed them. Mm. Cottage living and horse ranch are like that for me. They complement so well. And I've been really itching to kind of like get the horse ranch assets into my full game so I could really explore all these different outfit op options and I'm not done I'm not done because you saw how like I was just kind of going oh my goodness like how cute is that top from uh what was it which one was it let me just kind of like flick back through so I was like oh my god how high school years like the high school years top is so cute with that like there's so many more options that I haven't even explored yet like that one oh my god is that what was that that's not tiny home is it what pack's this? I can't, I don't recognize the icons anymore, guys. Uh, I need some, I need to link something. Hang on, let's find out. Because some of you might be like, I love that top. Which pack is that from? So let me actually go and investigate. Uh, so I think we're looking at, so we're looking at an expansion pack. Oh, it's from Growing Together. And I was bad mouthing Growing Together. I was like, I don't really like the cast in this pack that much. And, and now I'm like, oh my God, I love it. So nice. <laughs> like again, that outfit, beautiful super cute we love it i mean maybe that one's not so great let's find something that goes with that while i'm here um so let's go to horse ranch uh, oh hang on i've got kind of everything i've got still got everything enabled here um what do we want i'm like 
that's not horse ranch guys uh, let me just take hot weather off a second uh that's cute that's cute right i don't know maybe that top's a little bit too droopy but i think that kind of works it's a shame it doesn't tuck in more that looks really pretty actually hang on let's play around let's play around on camera a little bit like what else do we have here i think that's cute i think that works I think that works better. Um, so yeah, really cute options. Very, very quickly, I wanna just kinda like jump in and kind of add a guy to the household. So I'm just gonna do that. I'm gonna go and find some more fits for my gallery. Uh, and we'll just really quickly look at like how these clothes work together on guys. Okay, gladiators, are we ready? Uh, I'm going in with Flynn Eastwick, who's on my gallery already, and uh, you're gonna probably see a couple of versions of him. He's also in the like the rogues, rogues gallery that I'm uploading. Um, I think he's absolutely adorable. I'm kind of in love with him. Um, and um, what I've done is I've gone through for the tops, the full body, the bottoms, and the boots, um, and I've just tagged base game seasons, cutting, cottage living, and horse ranch. And I just wanna kind of play around with some of the options and see what we've got here so again immediately something like that like immediately is like oh my god like how clean looking is that um and then with like the horse ranch new jeans it just instantly right instantly like you've got a really nice new outfit there like with the oh i like the light colored like white and light colored denim is it for me and then let's have a quick look at like what boot options we've got i don't like these ones i've never ever used them i think they're just too chunky these seasons boots on guys i just don't like them these ones are very nice i uh, kind of he kind of has small feet guys <laughs> uh but yeah let's just make his feet a little bit bigger let's um let's make him better endowed in the in the feet regions because i think he deserves it he's he's a good boy like that uh yeah like how cute is this and then like the little kind of sorry i haven't tagged it for this oh my goodness look at that what is that that's growing together that little growing together hat how adorable i was gonna go for a horse, horse ranch hat but got distracted by growing together how cute is that like ready for the farm i do feel like something like um I don't know where are the I should have hang on guys let me just let me just let me have a moment here seasons uh cottage living and horse ranch I'm sorry growing together hat you are not part of this uh <laughs> this video um it's like I am and I will be like oh my god I love it so much like instantly instantly we found a really cute out of it um let's keep going so let's go to this cottage living top like how nice is this though? Like you could go with something like that. Um, what else have we got here? So the horse ranch uh, pants, let's give them the dirt. <gasps> Chim chimney chi, he looks good to me. <laughs> uh, and then like these, like, oh my goodness. How nice is that? I kind of love it with that hat as well. Let me just kind of like get rid of some of the existing outfits and we'll just kind of like keep going and exploring. So let's give him, um, let's give him different bottoms. So bottoms from like these, I love these jeans so much. These little cottage living, uh, denim, um, words are hard. These little cottage living jeans with like the little roll up. Uh, let's change, uh, maybe not the wellies. Uh, let's go back to those little, uh, seasons uh -huh. boots. I think they're quite cute. Um, and let's have a horse ranch top. Oh my God, guys, it just worked. I mean, it just works so well together. What can I say? Like the little seasons donkey jacket too. Oh. There's so many good options, I can't. Uh, here you go, so like going into Horse Ranch, like what about one of these? Mm -hmm. Like, oh my God, again, he's giving chimney sweet vibes. Like, please sir, can I have some more? Like, uh, do you know what? Actually, I do want more because I really love <laughs> the cast in these pants. How cute, he looks like he's, he looks like he is like a produ production director on a movie set directing the latest Mary Poppins movie. Don't you think? Like he is giving serious actor vibes in that outfit. I, I really love it. I really, really love it. Uh, I've got to keep going though. I'm just going to keep just deleting these outfits and kind of adding more. Like, oh my God, it just works so well. And I swear to God, like this pack is it for me. I love it so, so much. Um, 
like oh it just combines so well with everything it's like i am not disappointed here guys let me go to that one and then there's this swatch that i really like on this like that kind of swatch is there like a blue and white as well or did i imagine that oh like that one that's really nice too like the tonal colors like i really really like it what if i go like a darker blue like that is so nice <laughs> I could I have spent literally I think I spent about 30 hours with early access I only just saw it as I was in uninstall it it kind of like flashed up and that's when I was online and not offline as well I spent hours hours and hours and hours just in horse ranch and base game cast so now that I've got it in my main game I'm just it's like all I want to do uh -huh. all I want to do all I want to do is touch you um yeah I just I, I am obsessed guys I'm ob I'm obsessed I love it like, I can't rave about Cassie. So, to wrap it up, what I want to say is, if you were sick to death of your, like, of this kind of BS, of this kind of BS that we've had to deal with so far in, like, older games, you remember when we used to scroll through men's, like, full body cast, and you just want to cry because you'd be like, I just want to make hot guys, and all these clothes are just absolutely, like, like, bonkers, like, maybe not that one, but, like, like, the, all the clothes are, like, so ugly or weird and unwearable, not all of them, there's one or two that are nice, but, like, I was, like, crying, and then these packs, these three packs together, are just giving me everything I could have possibly ever wanted from cars for menswear. Maybe full body outfits could still do with a few better options, but the whole mixing and matching, like the mixing and matching from these packs is is just, it's next level. It's absolutely next level. I hate those though. <laughs> like, do you see what I mean? Like instantly, like just, oh, it's just so much easier now it's so much easier to make attractive like cuddly looking guys and thank you thank you sims team my lord and saviors you know i appreciate your faces so much thank you for finally giving our male sims or uh or sims who prefer male clothing actual good clothing i appreciate your faces so much now Maybe I didn't before, but I do now. <laughs> uh, one more. I've got to do one more. And I've got to do... Oh, my God. Like, these are so good. Like, look, again, instantly, like, the little Seasons jeans. Like, you can actually go with something quite cute like that. It's like, we're all going on our summer holidays. Like, these are actually... And, again, I don't tend to wear these very much. But they kind of work with that outfit. <laughs> I am shocked. I am shooketh to the core. I kind of want to give this one a try. What can I pair this with? Right, I can really like this. Like the black on black as well. Like, oh, daddy. Um, like, like, how does that look with, like, that? Again, maybe I don't wear these very often in the game. Maybe I overlook them, but they're kind of working. Like, work it, baby. Um, like, what else as well? Like, um, these are again are ones that I got a bit fed up of kind of like the tight bottoms I feel like that's a bit of an outdated look now but uh like season no okay maybe the maybe the pants aren't the best maybe those kind of work but again I'm sick of the stuff with the seams so to get actual just just denim like this is everything to me let's get I'm sorry I need to keep going this is gonna be the last one I swear I swear it'll be the last one give me something that's like oh, what have we got what have we got here like maybe this. <laughs> oh my god. Like this is a man who appreciates his grandma. <laughs> it's cute. What can I say? Let's change it to that other hat. <laughs> he's going seeing his grandma, so he's wearing the shirt that, that she got him. <laughs> because he loves his grandma. I'm going to leave it there uh, for Cass. Um, again, this is, um, 
I really want to show the mix and match potential of Horse Ranch and how, you know, we've really kind of been missing a lot of this in our game so far. Uh, so to be able to kind of like go in and just kind of have all these really, really nice menswear assets and just the, the mix and match potential that we've seen on like the women's wear. I just wanted to give you a few more outfit ideas for like what you can combine stuff with to have like different styles. I hope this was helpful to you. I hope I've done my early access masters proud. <laughs> because that's the thing um, and uh yeah thank you again to ea for trusting me with their baby and i i hope i hope i've done a decent job i hope i've brought something to the table and uh yeah show me your outfit show me your sims i'm at cinderella mouse on twitter my gallery id is cinderella mouse come and find me show me your stuff and oh my god i i don't normally wear my hair straight but i had to wash it this morning so it's just kind of would you trust this woman, this woman who's got mad hair to sh teach you cast? Probably not, but yeah, here we are. Thank you for making it to the end of the video. I will see you again soon. Have a good week, friends. Bye.